M142 HIMARS, High Mobility Artillery Rocket System, translates as High Mobility Artillery Rocket System, in fact it is a multiple launch rocket system on a wheel chassis, produced in the USA and the NATO bloc. Its predecessor, and the first such system, was the M270 MLRS, Multiple Launch Rocket System, translated as MLRS Multiple Launch Rocket System, it is on a track chassis, it had 12 227mm caliber guides in two TPKs, transport and launch containers. The M142 was left with one TPK and the tracks were replaced with wheels, which increased its mobility. Also replaced most of the electronics and the overall design. Подпишитесь на канал, дальше будет интересней. Заранее спасибо. The M142 HIMARS has a modified Stuart Stevenson 5-ton truck chassis with six-wheel drive. A diesel six-cylinder Caterpillar 3116 attic engine with gas turbine supercharging, 6. 6L, 290 horsepower, delivering 2,600 RPM is installed. There is a 56-gallon fuel reserve, allowing you to travel 480 kilometers without refueling. Installed automatic 7-speed transmission Allison. Suspension, parabolic with leaf springs. It has a clearance, ground clearance, of 564 millimeters. There is a Ford up to 0. 9 M deep. It is necessary to distinguish between MLRS, the classic MLRS with unguided rockets, M26 and M28, which hit areas with relatively little accuracy. And GMLRS, a tactical missile system that hits specific targets with high accuracy. The latest generation of rockets are equipped with INS, Inertial Navigation System, and GPS, having a minimum CEP, Circular Probable Deviation, of only 7 meters in diameter. Modern electronics allow you to fire a few minutes after stopping, deployment time 8 minutes, pointing 16 seconds. In this case, neither leveling, alignment relative to the position on the ground, nor topographic and geodetic preparation is required, all adjustments are made by the computer in automatic mode. Only target coordinates received from satellite or UAV are required. Ammunition and the threat they pose. HIMARS is capable of using all unguided rockets and MLRS missiles. HIMARS carries one TPK missiles, and the M270 already has two, TPKs are interchangeable. Let's take a closer look at the types of ammunition. MLRS Ammunition MFOM MLRS family of munitions, there are six of them in the TPK, include M26, 227mm unguided rocket projectiles, O M26 with cassette warhead, M77 sub-elements. He was in service with 14 armies of the world. Now their production has been discontinued, the projectile has been removed from service, but it can be supplied to Ukraine. O261 with cassette warhead, M85 sub-elements and extended range, ER MLRS, up to 45 kilometers. Removed from production and armament. O M26A2 with a cassette warhead, M77 cumulative fragmentation sub-elements, and an increased flight range, ER MLRS, up to 45 kilometers. Removed from production and armament. M28, training rockets. O M28 rocket in the basic modification. NER M26 variant with three empty and three containers with a smoke generator. O281 reduced range practice rocket, RRPR, a missile with a blunt tow and a range reduced to 9 km. O low cost reduced range practice rocket, LCRRPR, a cheaper rocket, with a reduction in flight range, 9 km. The only NER M28 produced today. ATACMS ATACMS, Army Tactical Missile System is translated as an Army Tactical Missile System. It is a ground-to-ground -ground guided missile manufactured by Lockheed Martin. Flight range on solid fuel up to 300 kilometers. The Atticms missile in the TPK has the M39 index and can be launched by the M270 MLRS and M142 HIMARS systems. The cover of the Atticms launch canister has a pattern of six circles, as on a regular cover of MLRS missiles. Don't forget to subscribe and like.